Day 23, Alice, why is 23 one of my favorite numbers? I don't know. Oh, she does, because this is our second take, and she got it wrong the first time. It's because it's Michael Jordan's number, she's a terrible actress. Anyway, it's Michael Jordan's number. Know. Well done for pretending you didn't know. <laughs> I'm Shane. I'm Alice. Lord help us, 23 days, I'm going mad. Core day. Yesterday was super complicated. There was all different times. Everything was all over the place. Today is really simple. We're doing six exercises. We're doing them one after another, and then we're going to repeat that four times. 45 seconds on, 15 seconds rest, that's it. Ready? You're gonna, so. you're gonna keep lying or? No. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's get into it. First one is called a dead bug. What's that look like? Lay down I'm on dead. the floor. Oh, you're dead bug. <laughs> Knees go to 90 degrees, hands go straight up in the air above your chest. Now, you're gonna extend one leg and then extend the opposite hand. So if it's your right leg, it's your left hand. So your left leg is your right hand. Chin stays down, eyes stay in the sky, 45 seconds. That's where we're starting. We'll just explain each exercise. It's a really simple exercise. We'll explain as we go. We're in this, day 23. We're on, let's go. 45 seconds, dead bug. Let's go. Go, Alice. She's been, she does it in the demo, and then when I say go, she stops and I looks and goes. I think about what leg and what, what I want what, to what do. What do I do first. now? I don't know, do I do it? I don't know, 45 seconds, I don't know. Right, same thing. Nice and controlled. If you want, you can lift your chin or lift your head. I like to keep it down. Oh yeah, I've done the exact same thing. Ooh. Isn't it for weird? Isn't yeah. It? Opposite hand, opposite foot. Nice and easy, get real extended. Try not to let your heel touch the floor. You got 15 seconds, that's how quick it is. First round won't be so bad. 10 seconds, then we get a little 15 second breather. Nice Alice, easy start, comfortable start. Three, two, one, take your little breather. You're gonna do a butterfly crunch. Alice, what's butterfly crunch look like? Feet together, <laughs> knees apart, touch the floor, touch your toes. We literally practice this <laughs> right before we film and she forgets. Three, two, one, we're in 45 seconds. Hands touch the floor, then they come up. Try not to throw your hands. So Alice kind of throwing them a little bit. Try to leave them back as far as you can. Yeah. More like this, watch. We do it like that, you touch, and you come up to there, and then you touch. You can use your hands for momentum if you want. That's the easier way to do them, is to throw your hands forward. That's fine, there's nothing really wrong with it, but this is just way more effective at hitting those abs. You leave your biceps by your ears for as long as you can, and you touch. 14 seconds, how quick is it today? Nothing, 45 seconds of everything. Touch, crunch, touch, Crunch, try to leave your biceps right by your ear. You got three, you got two, you got one. Easy, you're rolling over into a plank position and you're gonna do a little plank rotation. So start in low plank, then you're gonna open up, right hand to the sky, then back, left hand to the sky, 45 seconds, we're in, let's go. I like also how I said put your right hand in the sky and Alice put her left. <laughs> it's been a tough day. 23 day. days. Exactly. We're well, we're going to be at the end. Yeah. So you'll see Alice because her feet kind of stacked. You can leave them separated on the floor if you want your choice. So you can stack them or you can just leave them separated. That's probably easier to get used to. And then take your time. There's no rush. There's no panic. This is one of those classes where you'll do the first round and think, oh, it's not so bad. And then by round three and round four, you'll start to really feel it. <clears throat> Ab time. 10 seconds left. Come on, Alice. Not really enough space for me to do this, unfortunately. <laughs> so that's for it. Got five. <laughs> I got four, three, two, <laughs> one. Rest. Little sidewinders. Now, important sidewinders. You're gonna get your right knee to your left elbow. You're gonna make a big rotation to make that happen. You're on in three seconds. Shoulders on your elbows. Elbows on your wrist. Right knee, left elbow. Go. I'll do a kind of sire front on so you can see how much I'm actually rotating my body. And look at my pace, I'm not rushing it. There's no panic. I'm not like trying to knock loads of these out. I'm trying to make the biggest rotation I can. You might get a slight bend in your elbow as you twist, that's fine. That's no problem, that's cool. Got about 20 seconds left on this. Nice Alice, come on. Every time I say, shake it out, she says, come on. <laughs> Big rotation, big rotation, drive that hip right underneath your body, you got 10 seconds left. Come on, I'll join in. Because Alice is gonna need a break in about five seconds. That's all you have left, five, 
four, three, two, one, rest. Lay back down, little leg extension, lads. What's that look like? Head down, small of your back, down. Knees come to 90 degrees, and then you're gonna bring them out as low as you can, and then back into 90, only to 90. 45 seconds, we're in it, let's go. Extend, back in. Extend, back in. Look at her pace, it's not quick. Because today is all about just controlling all of the exercises. Keep that head down, that'll stop you from straining your neck. Extend, if you need your fingers, slide them underneath the bottom of your bum so that it tilts your pelvis and your lower back stays locked, super, super locked into the floor. Take your time, Alice, come to 90 degrees, keep those elbow or keep those heels high as they go back in. Extend 10 seconds. When they come in, they go to there. That's it. Small movement. Last five, last four, last three, last two, Last one, Woo. rest, last one. Feet go up into the air. Little toe touches. Now look at Alice's angle. They're not dead straight. You won't have anywhere to crunch. Angle them away a bit. Right hand, left toe, left hand, right toe. All the way up, back down. All the way up, back down. 45 seconds, we're in, let's go. It's a tough job this, someone has to do it. <laughs> What's happening here is I'm actually helping Alice because once I hold her heels, it's really easy. And watch how much your knees bend the second I take them away. Oh, don't bend, don't bend, don't bend! Oh, no! No! Come on, 25 seconds. Up. Look at mine, they're so straight, it's perfect. 20 seconds left. Big rotation. I barely let my, my upper body touch the floor. And mine are like pretty angled out there. Look, up there is all right, but this is so much better. Give yourself some room to crunch up towards them. The last five, we start all of this again in four, in three, in two, in one. Shake it off, 15 seconds, dead bug. Left hand, right foot. Right hand, left foot. The first one you're gonna mess up, I promise. Get ready, we're in this thing. We're going five, we're going four, we're going three, two, one. Yes, I got it right. I'm kicking Alice, we're in each other's way. Room away. We need a bigger room. <laughs> Definitely need a bigger room. Let's knock this wall out. <laughs> Get rid of JJ. If JJ's watching, you have to move out. Sorry. We need a gym at home. 30 seconds. I'll take one for the team, Alice. I'll not do it. You can do it. It's fine. Okay. It's all right. So also, try not let your heel touch the floor at the bottom. That's important. You might, when you start to get tired in round three and round four, cheat a little bit. Everyone cheats a little bit sometimes. But try for as long as you can not to let your heel touch the floor. That's what you're really working on. Last seven seconds or so. Come on. Come on. We got this. Breathe, Alice. Woo! Breathe, breathe, breathe. Nice. Solid. Done. Rest. Butterfly crunch. We're coming into it. Remember, trying to keep your biceps right up by your ears as you crunch. It's going to start biting this round. We're going in seven seconds. Feet together. I'll do it kind of on the angle. Alice is going from the side. We go right about now. Let's go. Reach behind. I'm gonna try and keep my hands right there. See where my biceps, kind of by my ears, and then when I get up to seated, I'll reach down and touch, and then I go back there as I roll all the way back out. So I crunch, up and touch. Crunch, if you want to, this is easier. Throw your hands forward and touch. There's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not gonna kill you, but it's just way more effective to try to keep those hands back, because then you'll feel your abs have to work a lot harder to get you all the way up there. Otherwise, it's just like momentum. It's like you're throwing a ball, which is a good exercise if you've ever done it. Five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. Side plank, rotate, side plank, rotate, side plank, rotate. 10 seconds, take a little breather. Whew. Not a crazy day. Yesterday was crazy. Tomorrow, well, tomorrow's crazy, dumbbell. 45 seconds, let's go, side plank. Rotate, back in. Rotate, back in. Rotate, that's me knocking on the door. So full rotation. I split my feet. So if you look at me, if I do it sideways, so you can see. Once I get into that position, look at my feet, they're split. And then I can get right back into position. So I just go from toe to heel and toe to heel. Alice is stacking her feet, whatever's most comfortable for you. You do you, boo. You do you. 10 seconds left, come on. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I've kind of gotten used to not having music as well. 
I mean, the Spotify's there down below in the comments if you want it, but weird. Rest! High plank position, side winders, right knee all the way to your left elbow. I'll demo it again. Shoulder on top of elbow, elbow on top of wrist. Go slowly with it. And then you really have to drive underneath as fast as you can. 45 seconds, we're in. Let's go. Easy work. Rotate, big turn. Look at the speed or lack thereof. It's all about control. All about control. Boom. And you're really allowing your hip to turn under to get that knee all the way up there. Turn it under, Alice, turn it. Watch, I'll help. Turn, switch, turn, switch. 15 seconds, if you don't have your elbow on your wrist and your shoulder on your elbow, you are not gonna be able to do it. You got seven seconds left. Come on, Alice. Come on, Alice. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest, lay down, leg extensions. The finger thing underneath your bum is important. If you can get your fingers, you tilt your bum up so your lower back connects, head down, knees at 90, we go 45 seconds. Extend, come back in. You can lift your head if you want, lift your shoulders if you want, lower back stays connected all the way through. I almost prefer to do it with my head down, but it's almost easier to keep your lower back connected if you lift your head up. You'll just feel a little more strain in your neck, so if you suffer from that, Hands go further underneath, head goes down, you extend, you come back in. 15 seconds left, come on. Control, length, extension, easy. Got eight, got seven, come on. Last five, last three, two, one, rest. 15 seconds, we're into the last one. Toe touchers, Alice, get them up. And let's challenge yourself. Here, this will make it easier, I promise you. Take them there about 45 degrees and try and reach and touch them. Reach and touch them. We're in for 45 seconds, let's go. I've said this loads during this whole program. Whenever we've done toe touchers, what most people do is this. They go straight and then you don't have anywhere to crunch. Your abs don't really have anything to do. You're just reaching. If you create a little bit of space just there, then you have an ability to get off the floor. Then your abs can have something to do. And it's also a little easier to keep your legs straight, which is what you're trying to do. Even a little lower, Alice, there, look. Perfect. Mine, when I do them, are more like 45 degrees. Ooh. They're more like 45 degrees than straight up in the air. Left hand, right toe, right hand, left toe. 10 seconds, Alice, don't bend those knees. Don't let them bend them. Come on, you're 25. Five, four, three, two, one. Ah. Rest. What we in? Round three, first exercise. Um, Only nine seconds left, Alice. Quick, 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 quick. Dead bog, yes. <laughs> right hand, left foot, left foot, left hand, right foot. <laughs> up, up's the hand, up's the foot, go. Christ. Here we go. It's a long month. 90 degrees, remember, it's 90 degrees. Hands up. Yep. There we go. <sighs> Easy. Controlled. <sighs> Easy. Control. Easy. Head down, lower back stays connected. Remember, lower back stays connected. If you can't get all the way to the floor, that's fine. If this is your movement, that's okay. If that's your range, that's okay. If your legs aren't straight, that's okay. We're gonna work on it over time and you're gonna get better at it. So if you can't extend your legs dead straight, don't worry, you do you. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Butterfly crunch. Alice, remember what that is? Oh, she's getting good! What are you working on? Keeping your hands. Yes, and then she did it wrong the first rep she did. Ah. And she did it wrong the second rep because she's getting tired. If you get tired, it's fine. Use your hands to give you momentum. If you're not tired like me, because I've done nothing. It's you're dry yeah. And you keep biceps by your ears and then you bring them forward. Biceps by your ears. And then if you need to throw them, touch and throw, that's fine. Touch and throw, that's fine. Nothing wrong with it. You got about 20 seconds left. Let's have a look. Alice, nice. Bring your feet in a little closer. There we go. Touch the floor. Oh, a little better. That one was pretty good. That one was pretty good. Alice hates core day. It's definitely in the weakest day. 
My core struggles with it. Weak. Yeah. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Not good news because she's a runner. That's not good news at all. <laughs> Side plank rotation. Ten seconds. We're in. Split those feet. Stack those feet. Do whatever you want. Just get a good turn. We go in four, in three, in two, in one. Let's go. See, there would be enough space here if Alice would get out of the way. Look, there's like half a room. Yeah, but you know what? I'm worried. There's, a, there's half a room time, over there. Last time we did this, we had to reshoot it. Why? Because Why? I was too far away. You were too far forwards. Yeah, so I'm literally... So the last quarter day, Alice really struggled though, because she ran like 11 or 12 miles, and then we shot it, and she was entirely off camera for the whole thing. So I had to do it again. Thing. So we had to do it again. She was dying. Which made me laugh. 15 seconds left, come on. I'll just sit this one out. What am I meant to do over here? I don't know. Check the lights, open the door, get the live room. Do do? Don't know. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Sidewinders, I can do these properly. Alice can't. <laughs> Hip rotates all the way under. What's this? Is this round three? Yeah. Yeah, round three. So we got one more round of everything after this. We go on three, we go on two, we go on one. Rotate under, switch, rotate under. I'll try to do it like face on so you can see. Big rotation under, come back to center. Big rotation under, control. I'm not holding my breath. I'm keeping my shoulders on top of my elbows and my elbows on top of my wrist. Give us a look, Alice. And then I'm really trying to rotate those hips. Really let your hips rotate under. You're gonna attack even like your back is gonna feel this. That's part of your core too. As you rotate under, you got about 15 seconds left. Come on, under, nice, nice, controlled, nice. For seven, for six, for five, for four, for three, for two, for one, rest. Oh. Leg extension, use those fingers underneath your bum, head stays down, lower back has to be pressed into the floor. We go again in five seconds. It's good today. Relentless, no proper breaks. Let's go, 45 seconds. Extend, come all the way back in. Extend, come all the way back in. And again, if this is your extension and it's just a little bit out and back in, that's fine. If it's a little bit out, stop, come back in. If you can get it all the way down so you're like literally a millimeter from the floor and then come back into 90, great. Try not to bring it in and relax because then your abs don't have to do anything. Try and bring it to 90 every time and then extend and then come back into 90 and everything stays under control. The whole thing is under control. 10 seconds, come on. Easy work, easy work. Last five, Alice, last four, Alice, last three, two, one, last exercise. Then we start this last round of everything all over again. Toe touchers, your favorite. Get them up in the air. We go in seven seconds. Come on. Come on. About there. Soft bend. Go. 45 seconds. Soft bend. Soft, that's, that's a pretty significant bend in your knees. Soft bend. I'll join. I like these. I'm good at them. Up, up, up. My legs are totally relaxed. They're not stiff. I've got a soft bend. If you can see, just a very, very, very gentle bend in them. And then I'm able to get up and touch. And I've got no tension in my legs whatsoever. They're just kind of hanging out there. They bob around a bit. That's fine. I'm making them stable down here. That's what I'm doing. Up and touch, up and touch, up and touch. Big reach. Last eight, last seven, big reach. How are we doing, Alice? Keep them a little bit further away for five, for four, for three, for two, for one. This is the last round of everything. It was really simple today. It's also quite a nice pace after yesterday Ooh. and what's coming tomorrow, because tomorrow is... Mm. Right, dead bug. Let's go. Last one, 45 seconds. One arm, one leg. Pressure, Alice. She got it! Woo! Opposite hand, opposite leg, we should be used to it by now. Head stays down, lower back stays down, all the easy stuff, just let's get it done. And I wouldn't even bother trying to speed this up or rush it for the last round. We're in it, we're just doing it. Simple. Boom. In and out. Boom. In and out. Same deal. If you can't get fully extended, don't get fully extended. If you can't get fully extended, do not get fully extended. You go to your limits and then we'll improve them. 
will extend those limits. Last five. Last four, Alice. Come on. Three, Alice. Two, Alice. Oh, my God. It's last one. Up. Huh? I'm doing the same arm. Uh, of course you are. <sighs> Butterfly crunch. Let's get Alice to do one good rep of this before we finish. One good rep. Oh, pretty good. <laughs> Round four. We're in. Let's go. I'll start doing Alice's ones. <laughs> so <laughs> mean. Reach behind. Touch. Oh, that kind of was an Alice one. That was crap. Oh, that was better. Nice. Feel it. Yeah. Oh, a little good butterfly crunch. Try to keep those feet down as well. If you really suffer with it, you can like grab something like a weight and put your feet on it. A bit late to tell you now in round four, but anyway. 15 seconds, come up. Touch. Right by your bi or biceps, right by your ears. As you come up to touch, last five, you'll get one more in for four, for three, for two, for one. Rest. What's next? Side plank rotation. rotation. Correct. Side plank rotation. I'll try and find some space to do it if Alice lets me. Maybe. She probably won't. We're on a three. We're on a two. We're on a one. Little side plank. Rotate. Come back to center. Side plank. Rotate. Side plank. Rotate. You can speed this up if you want. It's one of those ones where you can, as long as you take that little split second right at the top to pause and keep your hips nice and high. You can rotate and get some speed. Boom. Whoop. Easy. What have we got? 20 seconds left. Loads of time. Tons of time. Yes, Alice. Yeah. Last week, huh? Where did that go? Where did that go? Got seven. Got six. Got five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Alice, what's next? Sidewinders. Did you know that or did you read it off the timer? Read it off the timer. Yes. <laughs> Sidewinders, we're in. Get ready. Five, four, three, two, one. Sidewinders in. Rotate. In. Get wide hands. Get wide feet. Get wide everything. Give yourself a good, strong base to get this done. Rotate under, twist, rotate under, twist, rotate, twist, rotate, twist. Easy work, easy work. Got about 20 seconds left. Don't let it creep. Don't let those shoulders kind of creep backwards and your hands creep forwards. Keep everything stacked, nice and low. Keep it slow, Alice, don't use momentum. That's the old cheat. I'll just kick it in. Come on. Got five, got four. Last three, two, one. Alice, what's next? Hide Legs. it on the timer. Yeah, she got it without looking at the timer. Leg extension in 10 seconds. 90 degrees, lower back stays down. Head stays down. Head can come up if you want, but your choice. Come on, let's go. 90 degrees, extend 45 seconds. All the way out, all the way in. <laughs> Stop it at 90, there. Nice. Easy. Extend as much as you can extend. That's all we ask. Extend as much as you can extend. And if you can do this without, so if you can extend with like hands free, Woo. really good one, but you have to keep your lower back connected. It has to stay, it can't move. If it arches, you're in trouble. Head can stay down. I like to lift mine. I think it is, it's easier for me to keep my lower back connected if I lift my shoulders a bit because it rounds it out just a touch. Got eight. Got seven, got six, got five, got four, got three, two, one, rest. We're finishing this with some momentum. What is it? Toe well done, she didn't even look. Toe touchers, but we're at this. This is the only one I'm gonna look for a little bit of speed. I'm gonna hammer Alice. We're gonna go in three, in two, in one. Let's go up, touch, up, touch, up, touch, up, touch. Boom. Feel the rhythm, feel the ride. Get it up! It's toe touch time! What? Do you know what that movie's from? No. Oh my god! I thought you just made that up. Tell me someone out there knows where I got that from. Feel the rhythm. Feel the ride. Oh my god! Come on! From where? Cool runnings. 15 oh, seconds. That. Yeah, of course you have. When you were two years old. We're on this. We finished strong. Last ten. Last nine. 
Last eight, last seven, last six, last five, four, three, two, one. Done. What's cool running's about? About the tobogganing. Ah, uh, not really bobsleigh, but anyway. Bobsleigh. Run anyway, talk. she has seen no, it. I have seen it. I'm Jamaican. She usually lies about films, but anyway. Right, day 23. Yeah. Yeah, that was day 23. Done. The done done. Tomorrow's a full body class with dumbbells. It's a big one. It's a big one. We're going to finish off the week strong. And then we have a mobility day, so it's a bit of rest. If you're staying for the stretch, we'll see you in a minute. Oh, dear. Right. Core day done. Let's lay down for this. Face down on the floor. Lay face down. Or you can face it towards me if you want. Whichever. Yeah. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> Take a big breath. Blow it away. Lift your chin. Lift your chest. Just stay there. Breathe. Breathe, 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 breathe. Take another breath. Blow it away. Come down. I'll get out of the way. Extend your right arm out in front of you. Now what you're going to do is try to lift your right arm and your left leg at the same time. Pause for a second and then come back down. So just do that. Take yeah, a big breath. Okay. Yeah, do a couple. Yeah. No, no, no. Stay, stay, stay on that side. Stay on that side. Easy. Lift. Lower. Lift. Just kind of to decompress that lower back. There we go. Do another one. And then switch legs. So you should have time for like four or five on each side. Make sure you're even on both sides. Take a couple of breaths, blow it away. Breathe, blow it away. Tomorrow's dumbbell day. It's a heavy day on dumbbells. If you got lightweights, it doesn't matter. You'll still be able to do it, but it's big moves, full body moves, no isolation. Everything's moving at the same time. It's a big session tomorrow. I'm looking forward to it. Then we're almost done. Then we got like nothing left. Yeesh. Once you've done the same amount on both sides, take a big breath, push back into your heels, into down dog, head goes in between your shoulder blades, heels as close to the floor as you can get them. Easy, breathe. And then walk your feet into your hands, your hands into your feet. Round out of that slowly for five, for four, for three, two, one. Hands come together, make a big circle all the way to the sky. Interlace your fingers and then just take a little turn or a little side bend and only go as far as you can go, right? Don't try and like force this thing. It'll go as far as it'll go and that'll be it. And then come back to center. Go right side. And hold for a second. We'll do that one more time. We'll come back to center. We'll ease over that left side. Back to center. Right side. And then just kind of arch back ways, eyes go all the way to the sky. Hold it for three, for two, for one. Open up those feet and let everything fold all the way forwards. And then just let it hang. You'll feel yourself just be able to like drift a little bit closer to the floor every time you breathe. Take your right hand, left hand onto your right foot. Take a big breath, and as you exhale, take that right hand to the sky as far as it'll go. As far as it'll go. Back to center, hold it there for a second. Then take it onto your left foot, take a big breath, exhale, left hand to the sky. Keep on breathing. And then come back to center, round out slowly for five, for four, for three. Two, one, gotta finish with my favorite stretch. Hands together, round out your shoulders. Back for two, together for two. Back two, together. Three more, two more. Last one, making big singles. Big singles, big singles, big singles. Three, two, one, nice job. Core day is done, we are back tomorrow. You need dumbbells or a kettlebell or a disc or a rucksack or something heavy that we can lift. Big full body day tomorrow. We'll see you then. Have a good one, guys. Bye, guys.